started out in 1989 as LFO. There was three of us originally. There was me, Mark Bell, Martin Williams. Uh, in 1990 we signed to Warp Records and then we did the first record LFO, LFO and then Martin Williams left and then it was just uh, me and Mark Bell continued. And then we did a couple of albums and some more records and uh, I left in 96, Mark Bell still does LFO and uh, yeah, he's doing a lot of producing and stuff. Called Kushti. Yeah, it was at the time we did we did the two 12 inches, uh, G Man 1, G Man 2, and then we did like a, a mini album called Kushti of another, I think, six vinyl tracks. We then compiled them together on a CD, a mix CD, and a friend of ours, Mark Gage from Vapor Space, who's on Plus 8 Records, he, he like compiled a CD for us and did like a, like a continuous mix. And we put it out because uh, at the time, the, for the DJs, the DJs just bought the vinyl. But we thought it might be nice if other people would get into the music also with the CD. I went to Frankfurt and there was a really, really healthy dance music scene. There was loads of labels, there was uh, loads of clubs and uh, a lot of distributors. At that time it was a lot better than England. For me in 99 in Germany was an amazing time. It was unbelievably good. But now it sadly it slowly died in Frankfurt. There's still a scene but the most people have gone to Berlin. So I've gone back to England. <laughs> Over the last few years I had a lot of people asking for, for DJ mixes from me and to be honest in the in the mid 90s I did a lot of DJing and then I, I just quit I just uh, concentrated on playing live and then people kept sending me emails saying yo man do us a mix do us a mix for the radio show and uh, eventually I started doing some new mixes yeah and they, they turned out pretty good. 